We're in Dingle, Ireland, just getting ready to push off for Portugal. Our crew, Ana, is going to arrive here in a couple of days, and then I think we have a weather window to leave immediately. I am now going to go up to the top of the mast and replace our Windex, which is this instrument that we can look up at at the top of the mast and it shows us where the wind is coming from. We had a Windex up there previously but a big bird landed on it. It came crashing down on deck and broke into pieces and so I got this new one. Now gonna go up there and try to install it. I am going to climb up the mast steps which I installed myself. I'm gonna use them to climb all the way up to the top and install the Windex. But as a safety, I've got my sailing harness on, which isn't ideal, but it's gonna be good enough. I am clipped in to the sailing harness and Monique is going to take the tension up on the halyard onto this mast winch and then if I black out and faint and lose consciousness or who knows, I will not come falling to the deck because Monique will have the halyard on the winch and will be able to slowly bring me down. But that's not going to happen. Uh, just as a safety. We're also going to be wearing our Solidcom C1 headsets so that we can talk to each other. It's going to be great. Like I've gone up to the mass many times in the past and every time it's a big screaming match with me at the top of the mast screaming down below hey you know send up a tool or you know giving a report of what's going on up there and likewise they're screaming up to me at the top of the mast from the deck at the top of their lungs and not this time we're just going to have a normal volume calm conversation <laughs> uh so ready to go mo all right, let's do it. All right, here we go. All right, you ready? Are you ready? I think so. All right, I'm gonna go. Yeah. I'm gonna take up the slack. Oh. Yeah. Hello. Mast. All right, take it up. Cotter pins on the lower shrouds look fine. Everything looks fine on the lower shrouds. Same for the spreaders. Cotter pins look good. You should have brought a brush. You could clean those spreaders. I gotta replace this tide's marine track. Really? Continuing. Lowers look good. I feel like I should be wearing a helmet. Yeah, maybe you should be. My bike helmet or something. If you drop something, I'm like... Almost there. Yeah, how are you feeling? Good. Watch your Windex on that back stay. Uh, yeah. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Okay, good. All right, clean it off. All right. Am I cleated? Hold on. Yes. All right. So here you can see the Windex fitting here broke. So that's gonna come off. I've got the other one in the back. Let's not break the other one. Come on. You're doing great. Oh, sh. What just happened? I dropped something. Where was that? Uh, it's okay. Don't worry about it. Yeah, I'm off to the side. What did you draw? A uh, piece of the thing. Yeah, don't don't be underneath there. I'm not. Take the new one. Oh god, I need the wrench. <sighs> <clears throat> oh. 
all my weight is on the halyard. So you're sure that it's cleated good? It is absolutely cleated. Good. Okay. <sighs> Okay, that's on there good. Okay, I'm gonna need your help with this one from the cockpit. You're gonna look up and tell me if the Windex is centered. Is that centered? Uh, I can't quite see it. You're in the way. Stand by. How's that? Uh, like the two red things? Yeah. Go to starboard a little. How's that? Starboard. How's that? Yeah, that looks good. All right. Realize that you're talking to the woman who cannot hang a picture straight. <laughs> All right. I guess that's it. Let's hope so. Cotter pins up here look okay. You know what? This doesn't work. No way. Oh, uh, stand by. Maybe it's that. The f this won't work. This needs to come down. How come the old one worked? Was the old one really short? Do you still have the old one or did you get rid of it? Yeah, no, I got rid of it. I have a photo of the old one. Yeah. I don't know if that would help. Um, do you want me to look at it? Many months ago, when the Windex came down, Mo did take some photos of it. Unfortunately, I had forgotten that the old one had an extension on it. The new one didn't come with the extension. I need to make an extension that comes out here, so it mounts out here. Like a little piece of aluminum plate. I could do that right now. Right, I'm gonna take the thing down, and then I'm gonna come back down. All right, hold on. Let me, <clears throat> no, don't drop anything on me, okay? Yeah, give me some plaque. Cause I'm coming right below you. Yeah. All right, you ready? Yeah, yeah. Go for it. Remember, slow. You're still in control, making sure I don't fall. Okay, thank you. I used a jigsaw to cut a length of scrap aluminum into an extension for the Windex. This will go onto the mast with lock washer and a nut. And I'm going to put a second nut on there just, who knows, just because I can. I would have rather put a lock nut like this on there, but I don't have one for this thread. So I'm just working with what we got to work with. And on the other side, the vein will attach as before. I'm going to attach the vein now, get it lined up with this line, go up there, put that on there, and then move it like this until Mo tells me it's straight. Drake's homemade Windex extender. I think that'll work. This goes there, this goes there, and then we're gonna put another nut on there. Um, and I am going to put this on there. So I just realized that maybe birds are going to use this as a perch. Uh, so... Do you want to put something on Not right now, no. I just want to get it up there and move on to the next thing. But maybe in the future I will take it down and drill little holes and put spikes so that birds can't land on it. Okay, now you gotta tell me if it's centered. Uh, 
Uh, it looks like you need to go a little to port. How's that? A little more to port. How's that? A little more to port. How's that? Uh, I think it's just just about right. it. Maybe maybe a smidge, smidge to port, smidge. How's that? Yeah, I, I think I like All right. that. All right, we're ready to come down. Yeah. Okay. So great not having to yell at you. Okay. Okay, slack, slack, slack. Lots of slack. <sighs> oh, that is so off. That's my own fault, though. You got the trim thing right. But, uh, yeah, so it's fine. It just adds to the uniqueness of Paragon. Ooh. Thank you. Another thing off the list. <laughs> <laughs>